Hi everybody, it's Wendy from Cinnamon Sweet Shop. Today I'm going to be making some Nutella filled crepes. And what we're going to need for this is some milk. I'm using almond milk, but you can use any kind of milk you would want. I use my whole wheat pastry flour, but you could use all purpose flour. Some water, eggs, butter, and of course, the best part is this, the Nutella. So this is really simple to make. All I'm gonna be doing is just adding all of the ingredients into a blender. And just blend it until it's well combined. I'm pouring the batter into another bowl and I'm gonna refrigerate this for an hour so that the air bubbles will release from the batter that will prevent it from tearing. I have my skillet and even though it's a non-stick skillet I still sprayed it with some oil, canola oil in my case, because I don't want these to stick at all. So I'm going to take about an ounce of batter, pour it through the center of the pan, and then swirl it around till it reaches around the sides. And this should cook pretty quickly. Usually it takes less than a minute. So when the crepe looks dry, it'll get a little bit darker in color. That's when you can flip it. So now this is where it can get a little tricky flipping this. I always use my hands to help because I don't really have a professional spatula and I don't flip them in the air. So just to lift it up, slide it down and then scoot it over and you can Fix it up a bit and then just let that cook for another 30 seconds and then it's done. So what I did to let them cool, I used the same dish and I just separated them with a piece of parchment paper so they don't stick together. I let the crepes cool and I was just going to spread, not a lot, but probably about, hmm, maybe like a couple of teaspoons of Nutella along the crepe, leaving about a one inch border along the sides. Because we're going to roll these up, we don't want them leaking out. Now to roll this crepe up, I'm going to take one end and just fold it down a little bit, and then go to the sides and fold each side in toward the center, and then just roll this up. And there you have the one crepe. They're rolled, drizzled with some extra chocolate, and ready to serve. For this recipe and all my other recipes, make sure you go to the link below at my website, cinnamonsweetshop.com. Subscribe to this channel for much more. I believe next week will be chocolate, cover, chocolate waffles, chocolate chip waffles, something along that line, maybe. Anyway, I'll see you in my next video.